Well, hello and welcome everybody to the CCIE Security Addressing Protocols course. My name is Brandon Carroll, CCIE number 23837, and this is your course introduction. This course covers the following topics of the 350-018 CCIE Security Written Exam. The first area that we're going to address is the basics of network addressing. The second module will cover the OSI model, and the third module will cover TCP, UDP, and IP protocols. In our fourth module, we're going to cover LAN switching, and after we cover layer two, we're going to move on up to layer three in our fifth module where we configure RIP version two, followed by OSPF, followed by EIGRP. Now the RIP version 2, OSPF, and EIGRP modules will cover all of our interior gateway routing protocols. We're also going to cover an exterior gateway routing protocol in our 8th module, multi-protocol BGP. And we're going to finish things off by covering what your next steps should be in your preparation for the CCIE security written exam. In addition to these topics, we're going to cover some examples and we're going to use the following topology. Now, when you look at this topology, I don't want you to freak out because sometimes it can be a little bit intimidating. But here's that topology. Now, as you can tell with the topology, there are a number of devices. We are going to cover routers and switches. We're going to cover firewalls and intrusion prevention systems, things along those lines throughout the course. But we're going to be very specific to those eight modules and their topical areas. Now, most of this topology is emulated. If you're familiar with Dynamips, then you'll understand what I mean when I say that we're going to emulate the routers and we have the ability to emulate some of the firewall and IPS. However, the remainder will be actual devices. Now, those could be virtual machines, for example, the web security appliance, the identity services engine, the ACS server. Those can be uh, virtual machines, but most of the network equipment will be emulated with the exception of our switches. We do have some real equipment in here. We need to have real equipment because you cannot emulate switches, or at least it's really hard to emulate switches these days. So we'll spend some time working on our routers, and of course we're going to be configuring RIP version 1 and OSPF and EIGRP. So we're going to be familiar with how to do that on the routers. We're also going to be familiar with how to do that on our adaptive security appliances. In addition to these configurations, we are going to cover some of the switch configurations in our LAN switching module, which will be very specific to some Layer 2 security features. The same thing is true with the intrusion prevention systems. While we may not cover it in this course, we will need to know how to do some basic things on it like add IP addresses. Now in our network addressing basics, we're going to cover how IP addresses are formatted and how they're structured and all of that kind of stuff. So just understand that while we have this equipment in the topology doesn't necessarily mean that we're going to use it. So at this point, my only question would be, are you ready to have some fun? Because if you are, then let's go ahead and dive into our first module and talk about network addressing basics.